Maka's guides. <laughs> Hey, what's up guys? Mac here playing Batman Arkham Knight and in my last video I showed you guys where you can find the Freeze Blast hidden gadget location and in this video I'll be showing you how to get the remote electrical charge gadget which is somewhat hidden. You can get through a majority of the game without finding it and it's probably the second most rare gadget that you can have in the game. All the other gadgets are automatically unlocked by progressing through the game but this one does need to be picked up. So what you're going to want to do is go to the GCPD, uh, use the Batmobile, the terrible Batmobile uh, that has a, a terrible control scheme by default. You'll want to go all the way down into the basement of the GCD, the GCPD, and then go inside. Go past the area with the holding cells in the front, so we'll kind of fast forward through here. And make your way into the maximum security area or the office area in the back. Once we're in that area, you can do two things for this. You can talk to someone who will specifically show you where you can find the remote electrical charge as part of a side mission, or you can just directly go for it. So what I'm going to be showing you is I'm going to be showing you who you can talk to in order to get a kind of side mission pointed out to you. If you go to the communication room and you talk to this dude on the left here, he will tell you about Scarecrow and he'll tell you about how you can do some stuff. And then before you're able to leave, you will be required to pick up the remote electrical charge. I believe you can pick it up without talking to him, so you'll want to keep that in mind and you can just do whatever you end up wanting to do. From there, go across the hall to the evidence room and then go to the side evidence room in the evidence archive room. And once inside there, at the very back, there's a piece of breakable glass which you can go up to, press uh, whatever button it is you use to melee to break the glass and pull it out. Once you pull it out, it will be added to your arsenal of gadgets. It has some pretty cool things on it. You can obviously aim it using the left trigger, shoot it using the right trigger. Or for quick fire, you can use LT and then B, and it'll quickly, quickly fire. I'll be showing you guys some gameplay of it right here. Thank you for watching. If you found the video useful, please feel free to share it with your friends, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Peace.